In this lesson, I will teach you how to work with uh, terrain data. Uh, first, what you need is uh, download uh, elevation or terrain data from a website. Open this page, and when you see it, select server. This server because it's mu much more quickly than servers from Italy, and this art info in ASCII code. Then you you can choose area which you want to download. For example, we choose here, 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 and here, and then we click on this button. Now we will see page where we can download uh, selected area uh, one by one. So this is the first. Only click here, data download. Save, OK. And select where you want to download. Press save. When file is downloaded, we have to find it. Yes, it's here. It is a, a compressed zip file. You have to press enter on this. And this is the important file. Look, it is a very long file. 172 megabytes. So this file, this AAC, ASC, uh, copy to uh, copy to your SD card, and then you are able to import it to application GPS ILS VOR. Uh, so now I switch to uh, navigation application. It's here. So you have to press menu. Uh, then tools here import elevation data press this and you have to find elevation data on your SD card it's it's here look this is SD card this is folder GPS ILS VOR and now you press uh, this file and import uh, will begin Import can import of one file can last 10 minutes, 20 minutes. It depends of your of your mobile and uh, speed of your SD card. So now I, I will show you uh, settings of uh, terrain. Press menu, then tools, preferences. And here you will see terrain warning settings. Press it. And you will see terrain displaying. Okay, we we will have a look at first choice. So this is disabled terrain warning. This is aircraft symbol only. Uh, in the middle of compass there is aircraft symbol. And it uh, changes colors. Uh, in relation of uh, of your height above ground level, uh, and this is uh, moving map, which uh, show you terrain around uh, your aircraft. So I choose this. Okay. Uh, green height above ground ground level. If you fly higher above ground level than this this number uh, the terrain will be will be green red red height is uh, ele is uh, elevation is your height when you are flying below below this uh, uh, this height above ground level the terrain will be will be uh, red if you are flying between this and this, terrain will be yellow. 
and uh, if your aircraft is un underground or uh, you know, the color is magenta or if uh, some uh, some mountains are higher than than your flying level it is color is magenta this is uh, shade of uh, shading of map i think it's it's good to to be uh, to be checked because then you can see more colors than than four basic colors you can see shade of these colors and it means more brightness of color it's it's more danger for you so uh, more brightness is uh, more uh, terrain elevation and this is uh, map scale you can choose two nautical mile, mile around you one nautical mile or two nautical mi miles if you have a slow mobile uh, don't choose to do nautical miles choose only half or one nautical mile okay so it is preferences um, one of new things which I uh, program already program is uh, showing uh, unit here you can see a very small small unit here and what does it mean this uh, uh, this rectangle sometimes you you need to you need to to watch and aircraft is shaking and you don't see these small small letters here so pr just press here look i press here and you can see much more bigger uh, letter and so you can easy easy read, read them okay now we have no gps uh, signal so we will uh, simulate it i press menu tools and flight simulation okay so simulation I already set latitude and long longitude to course zero with two north and I put speed here for example 80 knots what we will what we will see now okay we will see we will see Innsbruck Airport I change speed to zero okay this is Innsbruck Airport you can see on Google Earth I open it in Google Earth yes it's here this is Innsbruck Airport you can see valley here and big mountains on the north and on the south of uh, of the airport you can compare look it should be same what what else you see here you, you see here this is your uh, course of set, set setting set set it course of uh, localizer look this is zero eight one if, if we change it for example like this the green green line uh, moved okay so I return it to right to the right position so this is localizer and this orange line is uh, desired uh, track uh, to uh, to wo to war to fix or to runway threshold so now we can simulate simulate approaching now look uh, this is magenta magenta color 
so we are we are underground it's only simulation okay we will fly Look, we are we are moving. Look at this desired desired track is moving. Localizer bar is still yellow. Now aircraft symbol is red because we are not underground okay I, I stop it here or I press speed only only eight knots look now we are approaching extended uh, runway center line so localizer bar is moving to the right position to the center okay I, I stop our speed I simulate speed zero so now we are helicopter now we are helicopter and look I I try to go to increase to increase elevation what 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 will happen? I increase elevation. I make correction one thousand feet. Look so. When I make made correction one thousand feet, here is green because we are one thousand two hundred forty one feet above ground level. And look here is very very big slope of mountain. Okay, so I set correction to zero again. And look, we are quite on on s uh, slope. Okay, so I change direction. Flight simulator. True course 81. Speed, for example, 80 knots. And I take vertical speed mm, 500 feet per minute. Okay, try what we'll see. So now we simulate ap approaching. We are too low. This is height above ground level. Look, when it will be below zero, everything will be will be magenta. Yes, we are flying underground now. So. Um, I switch off uh, simulation. So now you can, you, you know what is possible with uh, this application. Uh, sorry for my voice and English. I know it's uh, terrible. Bye bye.